Hello and good afternoon. Just wanted to uh, hop on here and um, give the list of March 12th birthdays for musicians. And we'll start it off with Lou DeWitt, born 1938. He died in 1990. He was an American country singer and composer with the Statler Brothers. And he their song that they that they're known for is Flowers on the Wall. Singer Al Jarreau was born in 1940 and died in 2017. He was an American jazz singer, and the songs that he's noted for are Breaking Away, We're in This Love Together, and Moonlighting, the theme for the show Moonlighting. And then we have Brian O'Hara. He was born in 1942, and he died in 1999. He was with the, he was an English rock musician with the band The Foremost, and a couple of their songs that they are noted for are Baby I Need Your Lovin' and Hello Little Girl in 1963. Then we go to um, musician Dana Walden, born 1948. He's uh, they're the he's the rock keyboardist for the group Champagne, and two of their songs that they're noted for are "How About Us" and "Try Again." Then we have um, a big name here, singer James Taylor, born 1948. He's an American singer, songwriter, guitarist, and some of the songs he's noted for, of course, are Fire and Rain, You've Got a Friend, and Shower the People. And then we go to Les Holroyd. He was born in 1948. He's a British progressive rock musician with the band Barkley James Harvest. And two of the songs that they are noted for are Poor Man's Moody Blues and Him. H-Y-M-N. You know, like, yeah, okay. <laughs> I know. I don't need to go into detail. All right. So then we go to musician Bill Payne. He was born in 1949. He's an American rock keyboardist um, with the band Little Feet. And their song that they're noted for is Time Loves a Hero. And then we go to musician Mike Gibbs, Mike Gibbons. He was born in 1949 and passed away in 2005. He's a, he was a Welsh musician, drummer with Bad Finger. And a few of their songs that are notable are No Matter What, Day After Day, and Without You, that was covered by Mariah Carey. Then we go to musician Jack Green. He was born in 1951. He's a Scottish muse musician with the band's T-Rex, who had the song Jeepster. Between 1973 and 74, he was with them. And then he went in to another band called The Pretty Things from 1974 to 76, and one of their songs was Don't Bring Me Down. Then we go to another well-known band uh, mate. Uh, musician Steve Harris was born in 1956. He's an English hard rock bassist for the band Iron Maiden, and he was also in a group called Gypsy's Kiss, with a song of the same name, Gypsy's Kiss. And then we go to a familiar Jackson 5 member, Marlon D. Jackson, born in 1957, uh, known for the Jackson 5, Stop, the love, the, say, the love You Say Will Be Your Own, and individually on, a solo, pro on solo projects, he has the songs Don't Go, Baby Tonight, 
When will you surrender? Then we go to musician Christopher Kip Lennon. He was born in 1960. He was an American rock singer, songwriter with the band Venice. And Venice has a few notable songs, one of which is The Family Tree and a cover of Ed Sheeran's Thinking Out Loud. <clears throat> then we go to musician Kelly Kayle Moore, uh, Kayle Bryan. She was born in 1975. She's a, she was a she's a member of the British pop singing group Eternal, and their song that they're noted for is "I Want to Be the Only One." Then we go to musician Ben Kenny. Born in 1977, he's an American rock guitarist slash bassist um, with two groups. The first one was The Roots from 2000, 2000 to 2003, and they had a song called Dynamite. And then um, he was then, uh, he then moved on to the band Incubus, which is a far more no, well-known band. And he was with them from 2003 until um, they stopped playing. I'm guessing they're still going, but I don't know. I, I need to look into that. Um, and they had a, a song called I Wish You Were Here. Then we go on to musician and singer-songwriter Pete Doherty, born in 1979. He's a he's a British singer-songwriter with the group The Libertines. And they had a song called The Heart uh, Heart of the Matter. And then we have uh, a singer by the name of Sharifa, born in 1984. She's an American RB singer, and her claim to fame that I know of is a duet with um, Ludacris and her singing Need a Boss. And then we have the last one on our list for today is musician Danny Jones, born 1986. He's an English singer with the band McFly. And their one of their songs, which I thought was pretty catchy, is the call is the um, the song called "TikTok Girl." So there you have it. There's your March twelfth musicians' birthdays, and I just wanted to take the time to say, hey, if you like the programming I'm um, and the information I'm bestowing onto you, feel free to hit that subscribe button and hit that like button really hard. And then if you have any comments or um, suggestions or anything that you might know that I don't know about those, those band members, feel free to drop those down in the comments section down below as well. And I hope to see you in the next video. You guys have a wonderful day. I will probably be dropping some more song versus songs. So get ready for those here in a little bit. Have a good day.